Tonight we're learning more about a crash that killed four people in Martin County. This happened just after 12.30 p.m. at the intersection of southbound Federal Highway and Northwest Baker Road. The Florida Highway Patrol says a Tesla sedan slammed into a minivan. The Tesla flipped over and burst into flames. The wreck shut down traffic on Federal Highway for hours. Our WPTV's Joe Lopez spoke with a witness who tried to help. Witnesses I spoke with say that the crash and the aftermath are like nothing they've ever seen. One man going as far as cutting one of the victims out of her seatbelt, pulling her out of the car and then doing CPR. I saw what was pulled out of that Tesla and they were kids. They were kids. It's been an emotional day for people in Stewart. It was the most horrific thing I've ever seen in my entire life. After a crash between a Tesla with two teens and a minivan with an elderly couple left all four people dead. I watched them put the drape over the body and I watched them pull the other man out. And this car was coming this way. Christina Stamper was a few cars behind the crash and pulled over to call 911. So many people here just want to help and be there for their neighbors and do whatever they can. And I think that's amazing. One of those Good Samaritans, Robert Biber, who tried to rescue the teens from the Tesla. Face to face, I tried to crawl up underneath the car to try to at least do something there. But the, the fact of the it was exploding, people are yelling. The car's going to explode. The car's going to explode. I couldn't I, I couldn't really physically reach the kid that was in there. That's when he rushed to the minivan and saw the woman was still breathing. So he cut her out of her seatbelt and started CPR. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. And, and that was it. Viber says he performed CPR on the woman until first responders took over. Wish I could have done more at some point. Um, and, you know, my heart goes out to them. It really does. Right now, investigators are looking into the cause of the crash as well as what caused that Tesla to catch on fire. We'll make sure to bring you any information as it becomes available. In Stewart, Joel Lopez, WPTV News Channel 5.